I'm Katrina Cotton for Investment Pitch Media. Thanks for joining us today. Hemostemics Inc., an autologous stem cell therapy company, has received a $250,000 letter of commitment for funding from the McGill University Health Center Foundation. Under the letter of commitment, the MUHC Foundation will fund $250,000 of the clinical trial expenses and partner with Hemostemics. Dr. Nadia Gennetti and Dr. Renzo Sassiri to complete a Phase two double-blind randomized clinical trial of ACP-01 as a treatment of ischemic cardiomyopathy at the McGill University Health Center. In 2020, the MUHC Foundation launched its $200 million Dream Big campaign to change the course of lives and medicine. The Dream Big campaign is designed to ensure bold innovations like ACP-01 are well supported by philanthropy. To reach the goal, Hemostemics and MUHC Foundation are committed to working together with federal and provincial partners alongside donors to fund the Phase II clinical trial at the McGill University Health Center. Julie Quinville, President MUHC Foundation, stated, Innovation is key to advancing medicine. The MUHC Foundation is proud to help bring this groundbreaking clinical trial to the MUHC. Our partnership with Hemostemics will not only benefit patients at the MUHC living with cardiomyopathy, but create new knowledge that will benefit people with the disease across Canada and around the world. Founded in 2003, Hemostemics' principal business is to develop, manufacture, and commercialize blood-derived stem cell therapies for medical conditions not adequately addressed by current treatments. A winner of the World Economic Forum Technology Pioneer Award, the company is commercializing its lead product, ACP-01, an autologous angiogenic cell precursor for cardiomyopathy and other diseases of ischemia. The company's process for harvesting stem cells is less invasive, as the stem cells are taken from a patient's blood, which is a simplified process as compared to taking stem cells from fatty tissue or bone marrow. Thomas Smeek, CEO, has joined us today to discuss the company and this news. Welcome, Thomas. Well, thank you. The, the significance of the uh, press release yesterday is really twofold. The, in first, Firstly, it's that, you know, we're working with McGill University. McGill University Foundation has a world-class uh, reputation, and they really are at the top of the field. They've done due diligence on hemostemics. They like what they uh, see in terms of the technology and um, are willing to work with us. The second significance is that it enables hemostemics to fund its clinical trial on um, perhaps non-dilutively. And that would just be as simple as a donor making a donation to the McGill University Foundation that's earmarked for the hemostemics clinical trial. And so we're going to explore a number of, uh, of possible ways to make this a very tax-efficient clinical trial. Uh, in addition to that, we are going to be reaching out to the federal and provincial governments hand-in-glove with the McGill University Foundation uh, and you can't have a better partner going to the uh, the government, both provincially and federally, than than uh, McGill and McGill University Foundation. Thank you, Thomas. Let's take a look at the impressive credentials of the partners behind this clinical trial. Dr. Janetti received her medical degree from McGill University. After training in cardiology at McGill, she went on to pursue a fellowship in heart failure and cardiac transplantation at Stanford University in California, returning to McGill to become an attending cardiologist and an associate professor in the Department of Medicine. She is a former chief of cardiology at the McGill University Health Center and since 2021 has been the associate physician in chief for the Department of Medicine at the McGill University Health Center, where, along with her team, participates in the care of over 1,000 patients with heart failure. Dr. Sasiri is the McGill University Chief of Cardiac Surgery, Surgical Director of the Heart Failure and Heart Transplantation Program, and Director of the Mechanical Circulatory Support Program. He is also Associate Member of McGill University's Department of Mechanical Engineering and a Director and Principal Investigator of the Research Institute of the MUHC's Myocardial Regeneration Laboratory. 
For over a decade, Dr. Sasiri's lab has been investigating novel methods to strengthen the stem cell-induced regeneration of infarcted heart tissue, having utilized placenta-derived stem cells and investigated their regenerative potential in different animal models of myocardial infarction. More recently, Dr. Sasiri's lab is actively involved in a project to create a platform to generate patient-specific cardiomyocytes from the blood of patients with heart failure. Dr. Sasiri's lab recently published a systematic review and meta-analysis that demonstrated that stem cells combined with bioactive scaffolds provide enhanced tissue regeneration in animal models of MI compared to stem cells injected alone. This study paves the way for future research and clinical trials supporting the use of ACPO1-based bioactive scaffolds to improve the stem cell-induced repair after AMI. The shares are currently trading at 25 cents. For more information, please visit the company's website at hemostemics.com. Contact Thomas Smeek, President, CEO, and Co-Founder at 905-580-4170 or by email at tsmeek at hemostemics.com. I'm Katrina Cotton for Investment Pitch Media.